Jim Lytle's Quad L stands as one of the most audacious and innovative creations in the history of drag racing. Born from the mind of Jim Lytle, a mechanical prodigy from Michigan, the Quad L represents the pinnacle of his relentless pursuit of power and speed. Lytle's journey began in his teens, inspired by the raw power of Allison V-12 aircraft engines at the Gold Cup hydroplane races. His passion led him to the burgeoning National Hot Rod Association scene, where he encountered the Aarons brothers and their Allison-powered Green Monster II. The dragster was conceived in the winter of 1964, envisioned as a four-engine competition coupe boasting an astonishing 8,000 horsepower and 9,200 foot-pounds of torque. The car featured a 160-inch wheelbase and four massive Allison V12 engines, each capable of producing 3,000 horsepower unmodified. The design was a marvel of engineering, with custom-made wheels and an intricate throttle system. However, despite its promise, the dragster never moved under its own power due to financial constraints. The cost of custom-built ring and pinion sets and clutch assemblies, estimated at $5,000, was beyond Lytle's means, as he earned only $110 a week as a design draftsman. The dragster's legacy is marked by its innovative design and the buzz it generated. Listed in the 1974 Guinness Book of World Records as the most powerful piston engine car ever built, it was a sight to behold with its 96 exhaust pipes and 6,840 cubic inches. The car's potential performance, estimated at 12,000 horsepower and 10,000 foot-pounds of torque, remains a subject of heartbreaking speculation. After Lytle sold the dragster to stuntman Tex Collins for $4,000, the car faced an uncertain future. Collins met an untimely death before completing the project, and his widow sold the car and its Allison engines. The dragster eventually found its way into the collection of Mike Guffey, who restored it cosmetically, focusing on the Allison blocks and valve covers. Due to the scarcity and expense of functional Allison parts, the car remains a showpiece, a testament to what could have been the wildest competition coupe ever. Jim Lytle's impact on drag racing is undeniable. His innovations, such as the first multi-disc clutch and the first one-piece fiberglass body have left an indelible mark on the sport. The Quad Al, even in its silence, stands as a testament to a man who dared to dream big and push the boundaries of what was possible in drag racing.